Medical research is any type of scientific research that answers a question related to human health. There are two categories, clinical and preclinical. Preclinical research is essentially all medical research that does not require human participation. Researchers can use computer models, laboratory models and regulated animal models to investigate and understand diseases, test potential therapies and observe the effects on the disease and symptoms. Clinical research is any research that requires human participation. This could include giving biological samples, for example blood or tissue, answering health questionnaires, giving researchers access to medical records or taking part in a clinical trial. All of this is done with informed consent from participants. The ultimate aim of most patient groups is to find a cure for their disease. This usually means developing a treatment, which requires medical research. In most cases, you will need to understand the cause of your disease and the biological mechanisms that lead to its development. Both preclinical and clinical research can determine the cause and underlying biological effect of a disease. In most cases, the pathway to develop a treatment is as follows. 1. Find the cause of the disease. 2. Understand how this leads to the development of the disease. 3. Find a way to intervene to stop the disease developing. This is usually finding a protein that will respond to a drug. 4. Develop a potential treatment or therapy. 5. Test the treatment in appropriate animals to ensure that it works and is safe. 6. Test the treatment in patients to ensure that it works and is safe in people. If all this goes to plan, you have a new treatment. Patients often feel that they are not important to medical research, but patients are central to the whole process. Without patients, there would be nothing to research, and the ultimate aim is to find a cure for patients. Medical research begins and ends with patients. Patients can help researchers in a number of practical ways, including providing researchers with information about living with the disease, putting researchers in touch with patients to take part in clinical trials testing new treatments, and funding research. Sign up to our free online portal for more information on the research development process and the role patient groups can play.